Hi everyone, in this video we will talk about erosion and deletion in image processing in OpenCV. Lastly we talk about some filters in previous video, bilateral, median blur, Gaussian blur like that. And in this video we will talk about erosion and deletion in image processing which are very important functions which are, which are we need much in image processing and very useful functions. One is simply making the um, smaller, more thinner your edges, your your things inside images, and the other one oppositely making wider and bigger uh, anything inside your images. Simply when we check this, it's taking source image, destination image, which is output, and kernel. Also, I, if you don't give a specific mat element for kernel and it will use 3 times 3 rectangle for structuring element and anchor also when uh, while making erosion which part should be starting if you define as minus 1 which is also uh, use much generally if you use minus 1 to minus 1 it will start from the central iterations how many times you want to apply and these two also not really important you can uh, use just border default like in previous video we used again and deletion also uh, they taking almost same parameters as i said like before is same source image can be make in both any any kind of any number of channels like grayscale or color images can be both of them and output image will be the same size and same type with the source images kernel also we can specify with this one in both and position we talk iteration also same they taking the same parameters but doing the different doing the opposite jobs let's continue with the code side to understand more better in here i will use this simple images which i created in paint application in here mm, i put some dots some one letter some lines some is thin some is thick let's define first of all our output uh, destination sources which we want to see in the output let's call them arrow mat and the late mat then for kernel let's say element kernel and not define this now just starting with arrow arrow and the input image which is the source image output image which is the arrow mat and kernel let's say element kernel now we didn't specify this and it will take three times three uh, kernel rectangle size and continue let's define this as center starting from center which is more logical generally for some specific things they changing this and iteration let's say just one time and the rest not really important it will use the default one and see the result it in show eroded and erode mat when we see the result this is input this is output as you can see the thinner thinner lines gone because their thickness probably smaller than 3 because the kernel using 3 times 3 rectangle and this is smaller than that and it's eroded it's applied erosion and it's gone like this one also thinner and this small dot also gone and the others these ones also becoming more smaller more thinner if we make this uh, specify by ourselves with the get you don't really need to know this now but it's simple also 
With this we can specify our structuring element by ourselves, our kernel specifying the shape um, about morphologic, morphologic, rectangle, ellipse, cross section and this one we specify you will understand when we see the output what these are means sc morph rectangle and then size is normally default it was using 3 times 3 let's make it 15 times 15 to understand and again point it's a minus minus 1 because of starting from the center and now see the result we specified it this is input this is output as you can see many of the things gone only this one staying in the right side image in output image because this is uh, more t t um, more thicker thick than the others and this is still staying but the all of the others gone if we make this 10 Maybe one more will be staying. Yeah, this is also a little thicker and some pieces inside in here also still exist. This is erosion. Let's continue with the lesion with the delete and source is image, output is delete net and kernel element kernel point same. and iteration one again first of all not specify it like before and show it with im show deleted and delete not let's see the result this is deleted this is input now in here opposite of the erosion erode function it makings the lines thin, the dots not thin, thicker. This is the input one, this is the output one of this line, and this becomes more thicker, and this Y letter also becoming more thicker, like all others also, samely becoming more thicker. If we use this with the get, get structuring element, and let's say 10 to 10 and you will see the result deleted input in the right side in here the output as you can see this becoming more thicker dots becoming more thicker these are small dots also becoming more thicker even this small dot becoming thicker in here and um, what can we do here else deletion taking uh, before that let's do this not morphologic rectangle let's try others for example um, ellipse let's try ellipse in here and you will see the difference this is input this is output in the previous image if you remember it's little rectangle now the shapes more elliptic because the the um, structuring element using ellipse morphology to make the deletion according to your needed you can also choose that this one important and also cross one if you try cross section or others you can try by yourself as you can see this is also different making plus sign like this yeah cross one also like this according to needed you can choose that I will use rectangle for now let's see result again erosion the results in here and let's make this little small not 10 but 5 let's say I want to try something else input eroded as you can see the thinner one gone for example in your any application there are some dots like this 
but you want to eliminate the thinner one but you want to get the same shape of this thicker one again this is also becoming thinner but you don't want this in this side thinner I want to uh, the input one the same one so after eliminating this you can apply the eroded image the deletion again to get the input same shape of this side how to do this just image not input of this delete source image but error net and after seeing this input this is eroded these are the which I wanna get these things output but these are still thinner after that making deletion and I'm getting like input shape but I eliminated these thinner shapes in my image this is one example just uh, maybe needed for any application in your application uh, easily can be understand where to where to use erosion where to use deletion uh, this is also a method erosion for example to eliminate the noises to eliminate the small small dots small thinner thinner shapes in your image this is also a method to eliminate noise the lesion is also oppositely there can be some shapes like like let's starting this from source one ah. like this thinner one but you need these are more seenable more visual more visualiza visualization more increasement you can uh, you you may wanna these things more uh, seenable as I said for this you can use the lesion also to get more seenable to more useful in your application in your processing after uh, pre-processing step this is simply the lesion and erosion and you can try these things by yourself I suggest using a structuring element to get your own element kernel uh, don't use the default one and this is such simple and very useful and um, the developers really using these things in the pre-processing side much and you can try by yourself also in your site and this is and for this video see you in the next videos